Hey everyone, welcome to a brand new video of Mario Kart Space GGP. Today we're going to play through the Brick Block Cup and the uh, Blue Coin Cup. Let's get right into it with Six King Labyrinth, and I don't feel so confident since this is, well, a labyrinth. I think this was made by Mr. Bean back in 2011, maybe even earlier. But yeah, look at the minimap. I think that says enough. This cannon at the beginning is pretty cool though. My Wii doesn't like it uh, too much. Oh, you have to wait until lap 2 to get uh, through there. Like I said, it's a labyrinth. That one uh, becomes available at lap 3. Oh. What was that? Where am I supposed to go? Ah, over here. <laughs> All CPUs got stuck there, looks like. Oh no, that's not good. But what's um, not good as well is... <laughs> I mean, look at the CPUs! Oh, they're stuck. But soon, this will be over. Yep, they are through now because the route finally became available. Ah, oh, come on. It's pretty absurd though, that the CPUs don't know where to go. And I'm already lapping Toad, I guess. Well, Luigi seems to be stuck. He isn't. Okay, now every uh, in our route becomes available. So we can visit the Wigglers. Have I just left the entire field? I think so. Wow. Yeah, I have left the entire field. That's unbelievable. Oh, come on. Okay, let's uh, take a look at the absurd lap times. Yep, everyone uh, above 30 minutes. Ah, oh. there no competition uh, for me. Unbelievable. Mr. Bean, fix your game. Fix your track. Up next is Sky Grove. Now this track has mushrooms, and I like mushrooms, so it's good. The problem is that you can skip almost all of the machines. 
looks like. Oh! And of course that happens. Yep, you can skip all of the machines. Sometimes when you uh, uh, get on a ramp with automatic uh, low tricks, or just a tree branch like this, uh, with automatic low tricks, then, uh, uh, then you get a weird uh, sort of bounce. If you've played this game, you probably know what I'm talking about. There we go. That was what I meant. That Rachel was ahead of me! Birdo! What are you doing? Why did I do that? No, I didn't even dodge the shock or anything. Shame. Well, second place, and I mean, Birdo, uh, Birdo became second to last uh, in uh, the last race, so it doesn't really matter. Up next is Sky High Island. And this track is pretty amazing. Two laps. And it's absolutely amazing. If I remember correctly, this track has something pretty cool up its sleeve. And it's the water, no. Sea water is pretty warm when it's uh, uh, really warm. So you see that volcano? Well, um, you can go inside of it. And then it's like a big donut. <laughs> It's very similar to uh, that uh, battle course. Big donut from uh, Mario Kart 64. How didn't I get a boost? Doesn't matter because I'm already up to 6th place. 5th place. 3rd place. 4th place. 2nd place. Well, and now we're up into first place. Because Waluigi seems to be a bit stuck, maybe fell off. Well, that was pretty janky. I'll take it, of course, but... That was probably not meant uh, to uh, uh, be uh, that. Also, why do you fall off, the, uh, uh, fall off uh, at this portion of the track, even though you're at the beach? And you can easily rejoin. Uh, uh, Onto the track, so why is that an out of bound? Why? Just why? If this track was on the uh, on hide and seek, you know, probably everyone would hide in the volcano, or at least like what? Three people. Let's just say three people will hide in the volcano. 
But yeah, that was uh, Sky High Island. Critical track. Love it. And then the uh, final track of uh, this cup is Sky Shrine. And this track is pretty cool. First of all, it's in the sky. Second of all, this uh, track is pretty old. I think 2015 or something. So that's six years old. And I mean, there's a giant flying dragon. And you can do that shortcut if you land on the... Whatever that was. But yeah, this track is pretty cool. Don't have much else to say. I mean, there's flying castles in the, in the distance. There's a, and there are giant waterfalls. Which is pretty amazing. And I think you can do some weird stuff on the RNCC as well. Yep, like that. I am I still in first place? I did so many things wrong. What was that? I held the drift button and I held the direction. Why didn't I drift? Thanks, Birdo, for that green shell. <laughs> did you see that red shell that Birdo uh, threw? Yep. That one's useless now. Okay, final lap. Can you drive on top? Yes. And there's even a boost path. This is absolutely amazing. It has so much attention for mm, attention for detail. Threw back that uh, red shell. Ooh, triple greens. Ah, that was a good snipe. I sniped Birdo on uh, just right before the finish flag. That was absolutely amazing. And with that amazing uh, uh, snipe, let's move on to the blue coin cup. Okay, so we're back and let's uh, start with Skyline Avenue. Let's take a look. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is a, uh, this is a pretty cool track. Triple meshes immediately, that's good. Falling off, that's not so good. I drifted the right uh, in, in a direction. But for some reason I didn't and uh, drift in that direction. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. This is not so cool, never mind. This is definitely not so cool. Whoa! Thanks, Donkey Kong. Oh, this is not so good. Damn, Shock Dodge. This is pretty good. Never mind.
come on. This item is the worst. Hey, I'm not. In fact, I'm pretty decent. Let's take the shortcut that I know once more. I keep forgetting to breathe. Was that a shot? No, there was a babo explosion. I kept holding in and then down with the Z button even though I didn't have an item anymore. Views are failing for some reason. What's the matter? Okay, Rick this time. Didn't even matter because there was a shock. For some reason, I didn't have a lot of. Uh, speed uh, there. Yeah. I don't know why, but I just didn't have speed. And that is first place once more. And I finished uh, far ahead of the competition. It took Luigi, Baby Luigi and Baby Mario. More than 30 minutes. I can remember that on this track on 150cc I got 6th place. So I, I did way better. Hopefully I can do way better at slot circuit because, well, I didn't do so well. Yeah, that's the reason why. I try risky business, risky stuff, and then that happens. And you're going to about place them. That's not so nice. Okay. Ooh. Oh, come on. Oh man, why do I keep falling off? Well, it's because I can. Wow, I just floated there for, you know, for a bit. But this track is pretty cool. Like, there's a few posters, magazines, Nintendo Power, of course. There's a TV with a Wii. at this time. Seven. Nice. Oh. Finally, Nintendo Power <coughs> actually it's a good shortcut. Okay, happened to third place. We can get King Boo over here. He was just in shock because he was in a bullet bill. For the pip. Do the shortcut. Get this by the pip. For the banana peel. Get rejected by the invisible balls. Taken. Grab an item. 
get those points because we only got the banana. Oh, this is a Nintendo Power Magazine in a shortcut. Go off because we need to rest the side. And because that. Okay, we're down to 6th place. I think there was a, a shortcut on this track that you could perform. I'm, I'm going to do it. And it's totally worth it, let's go! Can we overtake the dry bones? Yes, we can. And Sassy's Slot Circus, 4th place, I'll take it. Wow, Rosalina finished far ahead of the rest. Let's try to beat her into the championship. But first, let's move on uh, to the next track. And that is SNES Bowser's Castle 1. This is your average uh, Bowser's Castle in 1990. 1992. Like, you've got lava, you've got swamp. You've got jumps over the lava. You've got fire pillars. Doing uh, uh, so many uh, uh, low tricks. When I want to do uh, them, usually in time trial mode, well, I don't get to do them. But now that I don't want to do them, or don't intend on doing them, it's pretty easy. If you not so good, we Diddy uh, uh, Kong, you ruined, uh, uh, you ruined it. We left everyone up to fifth, uh, uh, up to sixth place, and yeah, it definitely it didn't take them all more than thirty minutes, but I guess I'll take it. And let's move on to the next uh, track, which is uh, SNES Bowser's Castle 2. And it's way different. Probably made by another creator. This track is pretty weird because it's at the dead end. You could use a uh, feather in the original game, but... If you got there... You just have to turn around and such. Now it's just a mushroom shortcut. Which is way better. But still, so things happen. Come on, slow down. Yeah, the shortcut is impossible. And that. Nope. Why does this shortcut even exist? Picture and uh, uh, track whoever made this. What did you do, Bulletville? Why did you go the long way around? That was a great Bulletville. Except for the first uh, portion. That was pretty janky. Okay, another star. Good, good. Blue shell, let's go with the iron. Bam, shot dodge. Why am I doing this? Like, 
That shortcut is genuinely impossible. I'm not faking this. A blooper in four? Sure. Get snipe. Nope, I guess not. That's not so good. However, take a look at this. Ha! That's pretty good, right? Power block and shock all at the same time. Just a straight up swamp and a random mm, green shell. But we've won. Let's go. And that was Bowser's Castles mm, mm, 2 from Mario Kart. No, from Super Mario Kart. And that's right, Mark, the end of the episode. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.